I like hanging out with people that just work at like a restaurant or some shit like that. Those are like real people. That's the whole side of America that like, I like to make art for. I had like pretty decent camera equipment at the beginning, but like kids had like $20,000 cameras like at their house that their parents had bought them. So I just went the totally the opposite way and just started using like offbeat, weird, like vintage cameras. Immediately almost like it caught the attention of ASAP Yams. After working with Yams, like I've been good ever since. Like I've had a whole career blossom from it. It's crazy. Dude, this one has 50 million views now, that's insane. We shot this on like a big reporter VHS cam, like one of those from the 80s or something like that. It's crazy how far it can take you like doing something that hasn't been done before. It's like when you start out, you always want to start out with a... Uh... Chord progressions. And then you can kind of... After you get your chord progressions, you can like lay a little melody. I've always been super inspired by like vintage LA, like 90s LA nightclub. Like my favorite movies, Night at the Roxbury, but it's like I never really like fully listened to. It. I just like elements of the music, so I was like incorporated into my my beats. Every art form is totally intertwined at this point. I think it's like important for every young creative to like remember, like it's a race to create as much shit as you possibly can. <laughs> I've been spending most of my free time in Tokyo lately. It's crazy because like most of the kids don't even speak too much English, but we're totally in tune and like communicate on the same wavelength. There's just something so special about the young artists here. I really think that they do things for the right reasons. It feels more like kids doing it just to do it. There was a time where I like lived somewhere else and all I could think about was saving all my money and like figuring out how to move to LA. I just want to show kids that you can make an impact on the world in a huge way no matter what circumstances you're coming from, whether you're in LA or you're in Texas whether you're Instagram famous or you're not Instagram famous, it's not as hard as you think to make a mark on the culture in a major way.